I mean, it was kind of an interesting night. Uh, I mean, lots of penalties. Uh, I mean, uh, St. Mary's did a good job line matching, coming out hard uh, out of the gate. And, uh, I mean, whether we had a slow start or if it was slow by our standards, it was slow because of St. Mary's pressure they're putting on us. But uh, uh, yeah, but I mean, it was an interesting night. And playoff hockey, you never know what to expect. I mean, it's it's different season, and everyone's excited. I mean. It's what we played all year for, and like a lot of the guys, especially the older guys, it's our last one of our last goes at it. So everyone wants to win, and we all know we got one goal here, and we got to take it round by round. So it was exciting. Though. We knew that they were going to come out hard. They're, they're, uh, uh, I mean, they're a real well put together team. Uh, I mean, I think their uh, their management team has done a real good job of uh, of recruiting and signing guys and making uh, making key trades. And, and obviously, they're very very well coached with, uh, with Scott Thompson, who was uh, uh, voted by his peers to be coach of the year. So we knew that they were going to come out and, and they were going to play hard, and, and that's exactly what they did. Like we have everyone seen their rink; it's a little barn, and they like to play physical, and they get a little chippy sometimes. And you saw they were right in the game for most of the game tonight. So. We got some good players over there and just got to rest our bodies, especially the guys at the university, take care of themselves and, you know, get on with it. Yeah, and we put a lot of time and effort into uh, into our power play uh, in practice uh, the last couple times. And, and we, we expect it to score every single time it's out there. And when it's not, uh, uh, you start to wonder what's going on. But, uh, I mean, we got a lot of faith in those uh, in the 10 guys that we throw out there on a regular base for power play that they're going to be able to produce. And, and uh, I thought tonight showed that when, uh, when one unit struggles, the other one picks them up. The first one, Painter made a nice pass to me. I kind of got lost in the slot, and I just went with my, like, there's a little bit of a screen on him, and we did some some scouting on this guy, so he likes to go down, and worked out nice for me. I like to go high gloves, so got him going down early. And the second one, I got a nice pass from Trost down low, and just used the leverage it had, walked around him, and put it upstairs again. Mike, uh, I mean, Mike is a real character guy, and uh, you know that, uh, when push comes to shove and it's in playoff time, you know he's going to bring his best effort. And, uh, I, I mean, uh, you just saw him bear down a little bit more on pucks and, uh, and obviously put a put a couple away. So uh, it's real nice to see that uh, that he hasn't finished a touchback. We got to focus on Friday for sure in their rink. That's when we have to win. We're confident as we should. Home ice advantage is where we want to win games this playoffs for sure. Every every team wins a championship has to be good at home. But the important ones are on the road. And if we can go the next two, go up three nothing, and we'll deflate them a little bit and. Give them 1-1 one, one and get them a little hope, it's not what you need.